The mining industry of Madagascar is on a small scale, centered mainly around remote locations with large mineral deposits. Mining potential is noted in industrial and metallic minerals, energy, precious and semi-precious stones, as well as ornamental stone. The mining sector was neglected by the government for decades prior to the mid-2000s. In 2013, the mining industry, a main source of foreign investment, was struggling due to low metals prices and distrustful companies, attributed to a 2009 coup. Topic. History Madagascar contains deposits of copper, iron and manganese ores, graphite, rock salt, nitta, pyrites, and some minor minerals. By the early 20th century, gold was mined in alluvial deposits spread over the island. At the same time, antimony, copper, iron and tin were thought to be abundant, in addition to asphalt, coal, and petroleum. Deposits of alluvial gold were found in the valley of the Amposari River, a tributary of the Mananjari River, about 40 miles 64 kilometers east of Amborzitra. While the auriferous gravel was being washed in pans by approximately 3,000 local workers in the early 20th century, there were expectations that reef mining would supersede the primitive methods of gold extraction. In 1905, several syndicates were formed in the Transvaal to acquire properties in Madagascar, with some RAND mining experts visiting the island that year. <laughs> Production and impact The country has both small and large-scale mining operations. Gold output in 1904 was 2,641 kg valued at £316,995. In the following year, the quantity produced was 2,370 kg valued at £286,804. 10 tons of iron ore were obtained from a small working in 1905. Production growth rate recorded in this sector was 121% during 2010, which has been sustained by rise in substantial production increase of agate, quartz, zircon, ilmenite, rutile, labradorite, limestone and marble, cement, graphite, gemstones, nickel and cobalt. Topic. Legal framework The mining law of 20 February 1902, was amended in November 1905, amongst other provisions the charge for a prospecting permit was reduced from £4 to £1. The present day laws of the land related to the mining sector are Act No 2005 022 of 17 October 2005, which is an amendment to Law No 2001 031 of 8 October 2002, prescribing specific rules for large investments, Act No 2005 021 of 17 October 2005, which is an amendment to Law No. 99022 of 19 August 1999, and Mining Code, and Decree No 2006-910 of 19 August 2006 on execution of Mining Code. Commodities Minerals, both industrial and metallic, are numerous including ilmenite, graphite, limestone, gypsum, dolomite, silica, mica, titanium, quartz, gold, platinum group, silver, iron, copper, zinc, nickel, cobalt, chromite, coal, and uranium. Madagascar is also rich in precious and semi-precious stones, ruby, sapphire, emerald, aquamarine, beryl, tourmaline, topaz, garnet, cordierite, rose quartz, amethyst, and citrine. Decorative stones found are marble, silicified wood, and jasper. <laughs> 